Hey guys, I'm here with the unboxing of the Oppo K1. I literally just got the phone. I'm super excited about it. And yeah, I'm gonna make this a short one. Just see what's what. Here we have the, the SIM ejector kit. These papers, I really don't know why they put it there. And a clear cover for the phone. You know, these do tend to get yellow after a while, but it's good to have them here. I'm gonna leave the phone here for a bit. Apart from that, there is the charger. I don't know if it's a fast charge one, but we'll test that later on. And the cable. The one downside to this phone, actually for me, there is no Type-C cable and <clears throat> it's a bit awkward for phone in 2018 but they had to cut the costs at some point but at last here is the phone phone i've been eager to get my hands on ever since they announced it actually and i'm super excited my hands are actually shaking i've been waiting for this oh i accidentally turned it on as you can see oh my god it looks quite staggering i mean and it's already on, good. So it's fast too. The build quality, first hand, it just feels so nice to hold. And yeah, what the hell is going on here? Let's put it on English. Mm, I have no idea what this is. But yeah, it looks really good. But as you can see, <clears throat> being a back glass panel, it's gonna be full of fingerprints, so you gotta clean it every now and then. And as you can see, I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, here's the teardrop notch. The display looks fantastic, I have to be honest. I'm gonna <coughs> set up the phone for a while, and then we'll get back. Okay, I have connected to Wi-Fi. Let's see how the fingerprint sensor works. I'm going to have to take it away so you guys can see my password. There we go. I'm not going to do the facial one for now. Let's do the fingerprint. It's a bit slower than fingerprints on Xiaomi's or Huawei's you know they take around like two minutes to, I mean like 10 seconds to set up but being an under display fingerprint reader guess we could okay all done and let's see all of this are okay I'm gonna skip this for now and I'll just be done with. Here we go. The Oppo K1. Well, display looks sharp. The colors are great. And, well, you can see the gestures and navigation gestures are here as well. I don't know what that is, but I don't want it right now. The <coughs> camera seems... Nah, I'm gonna test that later on. And yeah, that's it. <coughs> First looks, it looks fantastic. Oh, the fingerprint. Yeah, as you can see, it's a bit slow, but... I mean, it's slower compared to the normal fingerprint reader, but it's really cool to have such a futuristic feature on a phone at this price. Come on. Okay, so it's gonna take some getting used to in terms of how fast I can <coughs> remove my finger and all, but yeah, it's really cool to have it. Anyway, I will probably post a proper review as soon as I use the phone for a while, you know, see what's what. But that's it for now. This was the unboxing of Apple K1. Hope you enjoyed it.